Okay, here we are. Parked at home farm. That's what we was told to park at, a little sign on the verge. No parking up against the road, so it's home farm. I'll put a, a Google Maps link below. So let's go and look at Ardenton Millennium Stones. Okay, park down there. Now we're heading for the woodland here. Somewhere in the middle of this is what we're heading for, so let's start walking. Okay, that explains why you got fencing across what I thought was going to be a little car park. Which is that little car park, but it's blocked off at the, at the crossroads, so we ended up in the farm. That's what the signs say do, so that's what we have done. Right, let's keep walking. Okay, I think it's up there, but let's pass left and right. Don't want your cycling, it's fair enough. I saw a sign at the edge of the, like the main road up, same where to park. No cycling, but it's a nice wood. Heading for the Ardenton Millennium Stones. Right, here we are. Let's go have a look around these stones and get a drone up and see what we can see. Okay, here we are. Let's have a look around with a camcorder. Just done the drone footage, so let's have a go with a camcorder now. Don't think this is actually an ancient monument. It's like 20 year old, a millennium thing. It's nice. Well, my guess is it's some sort of sundial it can get used as winter solstice. And there's also some more. Let's walk backwards. Not looking where I'm going. Spring and autumn equinox. And another one, summer solstice. Yeah, now I'm backing up against one of the stones, so... Ah, here we are. That makes sense now. I have to read it like a clock. There we are. That's why it's laid out like it is. It will do the time. Interesting to work that one out. It's what stone, I presume, is shone on it at a certain time. And you follow the graph there. A quick look round what we're going to do. We're going to have a look in Lock in Ardenton. This old school, Otsha village. Going to have a look round. So yeah, there we are. The stones at Ardenton. Ardenton Lock in, up by Wantage. Caroline waiting over it. Nice views up on the ridgeway. Done a bike ride up there, so yeah, that's here on YouTube. Ridgeway bike ride, about 89 miles over two days. Somewhere around here we did. Ridgeway, not sure where. So there we go. Right, just realise what these are. This is Venus. A little bit of information about it. Annual revolution, 224.701 days. It's rather exact. A crater diameter, distance to sun and earth. So I'm guessing that's another one. That's Venus. It's planets. I realise what the circles are now. Ah, this is Earth. Okay. Annual revolution, 365... 0.256 days so that's where the leap year comes in then I suppose every four years okay so it's nicely done I realise what the circular bits are now yeah, I've had it pretty much to ourselves in the drone a few people about dog walking paths that way into the woods 
be fair, little paths off through it, manger paths in sort of directions, good. Okay, let's go have a look around one of the local villages, see what we can see. We're going to Lockinge because there's Best Mate, it's a full size statue of a horse. Can I have a look at my Best Mate horse? Yeah. Might as well as we're here. Right, little extra on this video, it's a full size model of a right. racing horse. Nice little road, no path for you, but it's a little road to Lockinge, so it's not a problem. Let's go have a look around the little local village. Go have a look at the Best Mate horse. Right, just going down the road into Lockinge, Barton House. Look at that. That's very nice. A bit bigger on our little two bedroom flat. Okay, nice houses. Just walking up the road here. I think we're going the right direction for this horse. Right, it's a lovely old school houses. Lockinge and the horse is just here on this bit of triangular green. Right, this is a war memorial then the people that died. 1914 or 14, 15, it's World War One. People obviously lived here then. And there it is little sort of green in Lockinge that goes up to like the ridge rail of downs we've done it before went up there for a geocache once something hidden down a hole some Lockinge kiln or something someone do manufacture bricks I think long since gone <laughs> best mate trained at rest Lockinge three times winner of the Cheltenham Gold Cup 2002, 3 and 4. Right. So there he is. I presumed he was in the Grand National, I'm not sure, but there you are, trained and lived here. Best mate racehorse. Having a nice day around the Arlington Stones and Lockridge Village. Alright, Caroline sat there. Nice day, isn't it? Lovely. Now look at these. Very nice. Oh, let's get a photo of this. Look at that. Some sort of dairy cart. Something obviously done deliveries on. Let's go and get a closer look. Some sort of delivery thing in its day. Probably by a horse. Well, we just found our way up to here. So let's have a look what this is. Oh, come on, I'm doing some photos. Any information about it? Did it hold water? Is it uh, to do with a fire? Okay, it's obviously horse drawn, not sure what it was. It's got a nice box under it, so deliveries. Went round the villages and local villages delivering meat or something? No idea. Whatever it is, it's old. It's just a bit of a feature now. I'm guessing it's a generally old piece of stuff. Old bit of kit. Horse drawn wagon, you call it. A nice little sort of stream. So we can get the drone up here, get some shots of Lockinge somewhere here.